Olivia, we couldn't be happier to have you join our family. Unfortunately, you're inheriting a name <laughs> <laughs> that will be misspelled forever. <laughs> Olivia, our day has finally come to call you my wife for the first time, even though our life journey started many years ago. Brian and Olivia, you're preparing to embark on one of life's most rewarding journeys, the joys of which you do not yet fully comprehend. As you stand here today before all, your friends and family, take a moment to appreciate the love and devotion that you have for each other. This feeling, which is unmatched by any other in the world, is sought after by many, but only some ever find it. You are lucky to share this bond, never take it for granted. Did you know this person was the one? Brian said of Olivia. Olivia and I have known each other for over 10 years now, which is an astounding thing to think about given it feels like I've known her my whole life. The first way I knew I was falling in love with her is whenever something good or bad happened, she was the first person I wanted to tell. I could see us growing through the peaks and valleys of life together living together, expanding our family tree, and eventually growing old together. But I could picture my life, a life so vividly with her that made it undoubtedly clear that Olivia and I were meant to be together, and she was my life partner, my better half, and my true love. I do want to share a, a very heartfelt moment that we experienced yesterday um, that just illustrates who Brian and Olivia are. Prior to the rehearsal dinner, we, we went through the whole process and we had to make some decisions about, you know, with all the smoke out here, are we inside, are we outside, where do we do this? And I mean, she'd been planning this incredible wedding that, you know, for, for a couple, two years, I guess, right? So, you know, as we're talking to the wedding planners, and Lisa, I mean, Vivian, uh, whatever your name is, Olivia, and Brian weren't there yet. Um, you know, we were heartbroken. You know, we wanted Olivia and Brian to have the wedding that they planned for and dreamed for. So we were a little bit crushed inside. And, and then all of a sudden, Olivia comes walking in with this incredible glow and smile on her face. And it just shifted immediately. And, um, you know, Brian and Olivia were worried about if we're outside or inside or you know, how many flowers we have. They wanted to get married. They, they love each other so much, they wanted to just make it happen. So, um, 
You know, they showed over these past couple years amazing resilience and positive attitude that will get them through any challenges in life. So I love you both. So cheers to them. presents this woman? We do. We do. Mm. Olivia, we've been waiting for this moment for so long, and we're very fortunate to finally be here with our family and friends to celebrate this beautiful day. I vow to you that I always prioritize us and always do what's best for our family. I promise to always say no to breeding puppies. <laughs> <laughs> but to work together towards making every other dream of ours a reality. I vow to be your dedicated, honest, and loving husband. I promise to be with you through the highest highs and the lowest lows, and you're the only person I want to go through life with. I vow to always make decisions together, give you the last bite, <laughs> let you sleep in, and always share dessert. You're the most thoughtful, caring, loving person I've ever known, and I am so lucky to spend the rest of my life with you. Most importantly, I vow to always love you. Brian, you and I both know how indecisive I can be at times, but if there's one decision in my life that I know, is the right one it's to spend my life with you. Deep breath, deep breath. <laughs> you have stuck by me through the best and the worst and loved me for all that I am. You help me every day to be the best version of me that I can be. So I want to promise you the following. I vow to put us first and make sure we are constantly work working to grow together. I vow to love you and honor our commitment when we are near and far from each other. I vow to talk to you before we get another dog. <laughs> <laughs> it is a reoccurring thing. It is very much so. <laughs> I vow to laugh with you in the good times and comfort you in the bad. I vow to support you and your dreams. I, I vow to have mint ice cream in our freezer at all times. <laughs> and lastly, I vow to love you, hug you, and kiss you every day, and to choose you and only you. Brian, you're the person I've been waiting for, and you're so worth the wait. <laughs> Today I become your wife, your other half, and I promise to love you with the same determination and confidence that you've given me. I love you. By the power vested in me, by the Universal Life Church in the state of California. <laughs> <laughs> That's for I now pronounce Brian and Olivia, husband and wife. Brian, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> I now present to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Schultz. <laughs> My brand new pair of shoes
For those of you that don't know me, my name is Kevin Zell, and I've been lucky enough to have been Brian's close friend for the last nine years. We met our first few weeks of freshman year at Boulder and have been close friends ever since. As you can tell at the ceremony, I'm a crier, so I'm gonna try to get through this quickly and not embarrass myself. And this is my world now. Brian, thank you for not only choosing to spend your life with Olivia, but also with all of us. As you know, we're a package deal. And thank goodness you're in our tribe because you are by far the most responsible and grown up person in our family. <laughs> And thank you for letting me stand by your side today. You're one of the most important people in my life. And I'm so thankful that you found a partner as intelligent, supportive, beautiful, and loving as Olivia. She's also way more fun than you, so that's a bonus. <laughs> to my best friend. And his beautiful bride, to Mr. and Mrs. Schultz, may you have a loving and happy marriage. Love you guys. And this is my world now. when I knew that you would get married first because this relationship is going on a long time. <laughs> but it was some time in college that I could really realize that you guys found everlasting love and that Brian, you were Olivia's person. So let's cheers to Olivia and Brian, a couple whose love has stood the test of time through multiple phases of life and has continued to brighten the lives of all of us here tonight. We can't wait to see what the future has in store for you too. Cheers.